When we talked three years ago, we, we talked a lot about this, the, the social emotional learning work. We talked about the, um, the committees at certain sites that were doing site-based budgeting and lifting up student voice in that way. We talked about our LCAP student group. And all of those things were wonderful um, expressions or models of what student voice could do um, and attractive on their own. Um, but our goal is to make student voice systemic and an essential part of just how we operate, you know, which is why we're building in um, our, our student equity committees at, our, at each of our sites to inform the work of multi-tiered systems of support towards our outcomes, where we have a student governing board which reviews and goes as representation from our sites and goes over the decisions the boards are going to make and weigh in on that as well as contribute. Um, it is not enough just to be able to point to highlights of individual events, isolated cases of lifting up student voice, um, that does not affect your system as a whole. It can stay quaint. It can, it can actually put a wall around that and say it happens here and so we're okay. It doesn't have to happen in other places. The goal of student voice is to be intentional about making it systemic creating a space for it that has power and is expected so that we can grow our capacity as a system, but also with our students to grow their capacity in how they analyze us as a system, how they establish goals, and how they give their input about how we should go about meeting them.